Hello everyone, I'm Kay, and before I actually get to today's episode of Steven Universe Save the Light, I would like to share a little something with you, which I just find hilarious. Okay, so today at work, I checked my email inbox, and what I got was just the most amazing piece of spam I've ever gotten so far. So, what did we get? I got an email from Senior Health Alert. Subject, three signs your brain fog is early Alzheimer's and how to reverse it. And this is how it starts. Huge news. Independent researchers have finally figured out what caused Einstein to be such a mental powerhouse. But if what I'm about to reveal hits the media, and God forbid Big Pharma gets a whiff, it's all over. So do us both a favor and don't share. <laughs> okay, buddy, you got it. I will not share this anywhere. Don't worry about it. What is this new mental discovery that's getting researchers giddy like a bunch of schoolgirls <laughs> before I share this finding. Let me set the stage about what allowed Einstein to discover E equals MC squared while daydreaming. According to a group of neurological experts, his brain was 15% larger than normal. But more importantly is what that additional... okay, I didn't... I didn't get that part... and how you can tap into that same source of memory enhancement. In order for you to prevent your brain from repeating the same jokes and stories over and over again, making your close family... something, something is not important, you must probably balance the same element Einstein had in abundance. To help you do that is my good friend, Dr. Ryan Shelton. Okay, I'm... I may look up that name. Because that seems really interesting. He's created a shocking presentation that dives deep into the science behind why this nutrient can cause your brain to go on the fritz. That's all I, r all I can see here. Hold on. And how to identify the free mind aspects, blah blah blah, crushing the mental concentration of American seniors like yourself. Okay, so first off, first off, You've sent this email to a German email address. It ends in .de. I'm obviously not going to say what email it is. Don't want any spam emails, haha, because I don't get those. So yeah, I'm not American, and I would like to believe at 28 years old I am not yet just a senior. Almost there, almost. But not entirely. Go here to watch it now. It's free. And then we've got a fucking URL that's just way too long. Somewhere in there is real for Madrid Barcelona. Totally believe any of that. When your body drops its defense and overproduces a dangerous enzyme that blocks neural connections, you start to forget the simplest of things. You start driving off with your coffee still sitting on the roof of your car. You struggle to remember the names of people you've known for years. You can't mi remember stories and events that you used to remember. Losing your mental cognition is a horrifying experience. If you've noticed your mind beginning to slow down lately, it will only get worse. Unless you fix it now. So do yourself a favor and discover how the brain works and how you can regain the quick witty mind you had in your younger years by learning how these three mind assassins are destroying your brain performance by watching this presentation from Dr. Shelton. And then we've got a wa another way too long link, which I'm... it's... I think it's the same. I think it's exactly the same link. Well, I don't know. Okay, then it has just three stars. Signature. Three stars. If you wish to unsubscribe from future mailings, please click here. Or write to... Oh, they actually got an address here. Zenith Labs, 616 Corporate Way, Suite 24042, Valley Cottage, New York, 10989. Yeah, okay. 
So let me see. I'm not going to click on any of those links. I already deleted the email. I'm going to go to Google. I'm going to enter Dr. Ryan Shelton. Dr. Ryan Shelton, South Beach Skin Lab. And then we've got Dr. Ryan Shelton, N-A-B-N-E, Certified Doctor at South Beach Skin Lab. Okay. I'm just going to click on that, South Beach Skin Lab. The Dr. Ryan Shelton Philosophy. As a board and N-A-B-N-E Certified Doctor, Dr. Ryan Shelton has brought his unique take on wrinkle re on wrinkle repair and aging support. Okay, you're telling me this skin doctor, this skin doctor, Dr. Ryan Shelton, has somehow developed a cure for Alzheimer's. Well, okay then. That was six minutes of my time wasted. Okay, and now I'm going to actually start this episode of Steven Universe Save the Light and... <laughs> seriously, yeah, totally believable. A skin doctor that just found out how to heal Alzheimer's. So, yeah... I don't even know where to begin what's wrong with all of that. I mean, apparently I'm an American Z senior citizen. Didn't know that about myself. Didn't know I lived in America. Oh, well. Those spam emails do know more about me than myself. Okay, somehow this triangle door just opens for me. Why? Who knew adventuring was such a workout? Why does that door just open for me? I'm going to go a bit longer in this episode, but yeah. This... that's actually... that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I've never had such a fucking amazing spam email. Also, I didn't hear what Greg just said, and I don't care. I don't even care. All I care about is um, do the thing that this game has me do. You know, save Light Steven and get some star fruit. Gasp! Oh my god, are you really just saying out gasped out loud? Because again, I fucking hate you, Steven. Hmm, what do you mean, huh? Hessenite! Is that her name? Hmm? A crystal gem. Oh, you're just talking. Cool. Yeah, no, I don't want to so say your line. My prism wasn't the only thing that managed to stay intact after the diamonds retaliation. Yeah, the diamonds. I know totally what you're talking about. Don't even know how to properly use it. Let me show you how it's done. Bitch, I don't even know what the fuck you're talking about, so. <laughs> that should do the trick. I don't even know what the hell a prism is in this situation. And here I thought the war was over. Well, it will be now. Goodbye. I don't know anything about a war and what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> that, <monster. laughs> that looks ridiculous. It's don't say it's cute. If you say it's cute... Dave? Insectisaur, Furnace Face, The Bladenator. I have no fucking idea. I'm gonna call it Dave? Is that right? Dave! <laughs> Steven, did you really just name the monster? Um, well, yeah. Doesn't it seem like a big boss monster like this needs a name? Yeah, and Dave is definitely the name I would have gone for. <laughs> Ready, team. Alright, Dave, would it have changed the name if I... I feel like it would have changed the name there. Okay, that's kind of charming. So, let's see, what do we do? I think this is literally just... Oh no, there's another enemy. 
Well then, let's see how much damage I do to Dave. That's a decent amount. Oh, now I know what... I didn't know that was an attack. I know what these guys are doing now. I know what you're not going to do. Get away with that. Okay, what I want to do here is I want you to kill this little chicken shit. And of course you don't kill it, because why would you? You can play your star gem and... Perfect! Only problem is now... I need to protect him or else he is going to fucking stop his song. And I mean, we wouldn't want that. And I'm pretty sure punching them into the boss's direction is probably not the best thing to do. I really don't know how to handle these guys. Let's just wait just a second. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah, now I can actually attack. Every one of them, there we go, that's how we do it. Also, Stevo, you can heal Garnet. And now, still going to wait. Perfect, there we go, that's how we do it, yes. I'm just going to do this over and over again. Oh, up, Dedio. Play your star gem. Oh, there's another one coming in with a shield. I know what to do about, about that one. King won't. See? Told ya. Okay, these guys are just bringing more and more wood in. And I don't fucking appreciate it. wasn't too late. You just showed the attack too early. So now that I've already got wood. And that's not what I meant by that. I have no idea what that even does, so... I'm just going to keep whipping people. Okay, Stevo, you can show what you've got now. Huh. Should have expected that.
This might actually get tough in a second. What the actual fuck was that? Okay, you're gonna play your heal jam now. And you can just protect him. I know what to do now. You can play your fan jam. That should help me for now, but... I have no idea how to actually handle like a million enemies. favor and fucking stop whatever the hell you're doing there. Where is it? Together breakfast. There we go. Come on. I really have no clue what the hell to do here. Don't worry about you, you're not going to be fine, believe you me. Can you stop this shit with the wood, please? Oh, come on, I should have actually seen that coming. Stop this shit. You know what? Screw it, he is almost dead. Okay, that was a million times too early. <laughs> Die already. Well, that sucks. Come on, Dave. You're going down. I don't even care that Amethyst is dead. The actual fuck. Okay, someone just unexpectedly helps me. Yeah, sure, that seems logical. So cool. Oh look, it's uh someone. Someone I totally know. Unlocked second patch slot. Alright, you can now equip a second patch. That sounds awesome. I'm so glad you're all okay. Well, sort of. Phew, that was one tricky pickle. 
Thanks for the safe, Pearl. Wait, the prism! Oh, no. oh man, our prism is in another castle! Wait a minute, that homework gem, you said her name was Hassel Knight. Dish? What? 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 Yeah, what's her deal? It's a long story. She's a serious threat. We're frest. She's a serious threat. We're going to need to act quickly. Um, this kind of what kind of acting are we talking about here? I know where we need to go. Let's head to a warp pad team. Okay, so apparently we've got um, Pearl. Now I don't know. I have no idea who Pearl is. But at least I've got a few chests now. Harmony badge increases total health by 15%. Can only be worn by gems and half gems. Sword schematic one. All right. And here we have a warp pad. So, where are we going now? And why are there still two items here that I haven't found? I can't let that stand. But yeah, this might actually just be some kind of hit secret that I haven't found yet. Alright. And let's do it. Let's get the hell out of here. So, you wanted me to warp. Where should we warp to? Started. I'm just going to warp to this place that I haven't seen before yet. Best friend, saving the light, do, do, do. Bismuth's Forge, the secret entrance. Uh, does anyone still get a, get a little nauseous from that? <laughs> wow, didn't think we'd end up back here again. And this is? Come on, we need to reach the, the forge. Uh, Steven? You look as pale as Pearl. Everything okay? I'm fine. We should keep moving. Speaking of Pearl, I actually want to see what she can do. And I have no idea who I should swamp her out with, so... Amethyst it is. She can apparently just throw spears. And dance ballet. Switch to Garnet. Yeah, yeah, okay. Leave this to me. Well, good thing I already figured out how to punch shit with her. Pow. Um, no, pow blocks are actually something different. They don't destroy stone. They just kill every enemy on screen. Staff route, I can't get up there. I don't know if there even is anything up there. So... I have a feeling that I'm supposed to go in there, but... I want to explore. Well, good thing I did, because now I can... Lovely. Grab... A level up charm. Automatically level up any... Oh, it's a rare candy. That's what that is. Violet Chroma and... I assume... Then I cannot open that with her. Because I assume she's just too weak? What? That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> Didn't mean to fall down. Alright, let's go inside now. Oh, yeah. To stand up against Hassanite, we'll need a little upgrade. 
like, for example. Oh, good. The thing on the upper left corner is totally not in the way. Weapon schematic. You can see the chroma required to perform the upgrade. Alright, let's see. Shield schematic. Sure. Shiny Rose's shield. Perfect blacks now activate a short regeneration effect on Steam. No, that sounds actually very awesome. We've got another stop to make. Oh, oh, future vision time? You know it. Let's head back to the warp pad. Alright, but before I do that, warp pad time. Okay, let's just go back and see what we're doing at the warp pad. And as soon as we made it, I feel like I should actually end this episode, because even without that little tangent... Oh, the Great North. That's where it wants me to go next. All right, yep, I'm going to end today's episode here. American Senior Citizen K, out.